Rates, well, they've stayed pretty stable this week. Hi, this is Mike Weiss with your weekly mortgage update. Happy Easter to everybody. Hope you have a great weekend uh, celebrating Easter. Uh, mortgage rates, yes, they have stayed pretty elevated, pretty, the, pretty much the same for the past week. There's not been much changes at all. Um, they're right around 7% plus or minus on the 30-year fixed rate mortgages. PCE came out. That's the Fed's favorite measure of inflation. Uh, that came in as expected. Uh, inflation is still uh, going up. It's going up at a slower pace, but it still uh, came in kind of as expected. In fact, uh, one of the Fed governors, uh, Fed Waller, spoke uh, this week and basically said that he is uh, not in favor of any rate reductions uh, at this point in time until he sees data uh, where the inflation is coming down further and you know it's pretty sticky it's going to get very very difficult in the last part to get these inflation numbers down which i think is going to keep the uh, numbers elevated the impact that we that may have on lower rates is the employment numbers uh, the jobless claims they came out this week uh, they are actually down so um, people are not losing their jobs they're still keeping their jobs but the people that have lost their jobs so the continuing claims, this still continues to be an issue where those continue to go up and then the revisions afterwards uh, a month later uh, to these jobless numbers are the issue. So if we do see some uh, unemployment uh, numbers go up, uh, then we may see some uh, some rate reductions uh, in June uh, or July. So the, the, the Fed, they're still working on three uh, rate reductions this year. I'm not sure that's going to happen unless we start to see some of those employment numbers uh, change a little bit. The proposed NAR settlement is still top of mind to everybody out there. And uh, while I, I think it's super important, I do think that your value pitch, what's your value add is the most important thing uh, that you have to work on in these next 100 days before uh, they implement these changes. So, uh, you know, work on that value pitch and why you are going to be different or better than anybody else. Finally, uh, it is the middle of March. It's March Madness. And um, this kind of goes along with the proposed NAR settlement is I'm going to give you a video link to Kara Lawson. Uh, she is the Duke uh, women's basketball coach. And um, a few years ago, she put out a video basically on how to handle hard better. And uh, life is, you know, it, it, as good as it is, it, it is hard and it doesn't always get easier. And once you learn how to handle hard uh, better, you're going to get something else that's a little bit more difficult. And we've all realized that in the mortgage and in the real estate business over the last uh, 12 months. So this is a great video. Uh, click on the link below and you can listen to it. And uh, it's a great video to send out to your clients as well. So I hope you all have a great uh, Easter weekend and we will see you next week.